right, guys, today we're going to be reading Who Will Help Santa This Year by Jerry Pallada and illustrated by David Berserkey. I don't know how you say his name, but Who Will Help Santa This Year? It was too, the job was too big. I couldn't make all the toys. Look at that mountain of requests he's getting for letters. I had a workshop of plenty and great tools. It was time to look for some helpers. I tried dragons. Achoo! The toys got cooked. I tried fairies. What a mess. They left glitter everywhere. Bigfoot was a giant mistake. Only his big toe could fit through the door. I don't think he's helping now. I tried mummies. They were only good at rapping. I had some good luck with the leprechauns, but they ran away to chase rainbows. Mm -mm -mm. Who's going to make all those toys? I tried garden gnomes. Hey, kids like toys, not Brussels sprouts. Do you guys like Brussels sprouts? Me either. I like spinach, but not Brussels sprouts. I hired mermaids. Their, w their fishing was good. Oh no, the toys got soaked. Oh no, you're not having any luck. Aliens only made spaceships and funny noises. Meep, meep, and they never heard of Christmas. Oh my. I even tried unicorns. Uh-oh, who's? They couldn't hold the tools. I don't think they can make toys. The wizards wanted to help. Poof! They turned me into a frog. Oh, what are we going to do if Santa's turned into a frog? Elves came looking for work. They had great advice. Kiss him, kiss him, kiss him, they said. I'm glad it was Mrs. Claus. Poof! A Christmas kiss brought me back. Let's hire the elves, said Mrs. Claus. And Mrs. Claus, she's a really smart cookie. Elves were exactly what my workshop needed. They became happy, handy, working helpers. Look at them making all those toys. Now that the toys are made, we can go on vacation. Cowabunga, dude! There's Santa riding a wave. That's a pretty good story, isn't it? I wish I could help Santa. But he only has me watch those reindeer. I don't know. We'll see you soon.